for your 5 News at 6. I'm Erica Thomas. And I'm Darren Bob. 5 News reporter Bailey Devane gives us a look at the signage and talks with concerned residents there. The Sebastian County Sheriff's Department found three flyers contained in Ziploc bags on East Oak Street yesterday. They contain profanity, which has been blurred out, and it reads, White Lives Matter along with slurs against the Black Lives Matter movement, signed by WPWW. The Sheriff's Department isn't certain what that stands for, but they have an idea. WPWW, from the Anti-Defamation League, they believe that to mean white pride worldwide often seen on a lot of white supremacist websites. Neighbors who found the posters and called police are worried for their safety. And we just don't know, you know, if there's strangers coming through or what, kind, what type of people would do that. And they're angry this kind of speech is being spread where their kids can find it. Sometimes I'll get up in the middle of the night just to make sure there's nobody in the yard. That's kind of, you know, what goes through my head to make sure my kids are okay and safe. When Huntington officers are not available for a call, Sebastian County sheriffs take over. Captain Philip PB House is confused by these posters, saying the quiet town of Huntington is the last place he'd expect to see hateful messages. We ourselves uh, will do what we can uh, through various sources and investigative techniques to try to figure out who the author of this is. But at the same time, there is uh, freedom of speech in this country, whether I like it or not. And so we have to be very careful there uh, ourselves from a legal standpoint. In Huntington, covering news where you live, Bailey Devane, 5 News. PV House says deputies found three flyers. They believe this was an isolated incident and there's no threat to the community. But deputies are keeping a watchful eye for any more signage that could turn up.